Welcome back. It is construction season in Ohio. You will soon see plenty of orange barrels for the next few months, while ODOT crews work on more than 800 road projects across the state. Their jobs, as we know, can be dangerous, especially if drivers aren't paying attention. News 5's John Rutter has more on a campaign to help keep work zones safe. You've heard it all before. Whether it's impaired driving, distracted driving, turn around, don't drown, don't crowd the plow. I mean, these are all messages you hear often. But time and time again, we're reminded of the dangers construction crews face in work zones. Lane shifts, narrow lanes, uh, you know, maybe uh, an exit ramp was open for a, a month while you were driving through and then now suddenly it's closed. Next week marks National Work Zone Safety Awareness Week. Starting roughly the same time as construction season, it's designed to bring drivers attention to the importance of driving safely in work zones. I mean, you talk to any ODOT employee, Anybody who spends any amount of time on the road and they will tell you one of the biggest factors that they see is people staring at their phones, people not paying attention, uh, people driving way too fast. And those are all driver behavior things that we need to change. Last year, there were nearly 4,800 work zone crashes in the state of Ohio, causing more than 1,700 injuries and 30 deaths. These numbers are way too high and, and most of all of these crashes are preventable. Uh, simply by a driver paying extra attention, allowing some extra space between them and the vehicle that's in front of them, and slowing down. Those numbers include 154 ODOT crews that were struck last year on Ohio roadways. This year, those incidents already number more than 70. Just this week, a pothole patching crew was struck on I-480 here in Cleveland. These men and women who are out there on the roads are trying to do a job that benefits all of us. And the only thing they ask for those drivers that share the roadway with them to do is to just pay attention, slow down. When you see them out there, move over, give them space to work uh, so that everybody can go home safe at the end of the day. As traffic volumes rebound from pandemic lows, ODOT is using the campaign to ask for drivers help in putting the brakes on the trend. Uh, these are happening too frequently. Uh, they don't need to be happening as frequently as they are. And uh, we really could could use some help from motorists to, to try to reduce the number of crashes that happen. Reporting for News 5, I'm John Rutter.